prior to 9-11, I remember we were preparing for a missions outreach in New York City. We had the whole block of where the church was on 51st and Broadway. Uh, we were going to have like a, a missions affair where we would have booths and we would um, showcase different uh, cultures and places we had gone to. So this was going to be a big missions outreach. And I remember in August he came and said that the Lord told him to shut down all ministries, that something was coming in New York City. And I remember we were having uh, meetings every night. There were like prayer meetings. Uh, but it was very, um, it was a very sobering time. It was, it, there was a lot of crying and repenting and we didn't really know what was going to happen. And the, it was the first time I had seen Pastor Dave um, down on the floor one night wailing and just crying out to God. And I, it was so impactful because we would sit in the church. We would sit there and there would be total silence and no one would move. There was just such a, a presence of God, something that I had never experienced before. And then came 9-11. And when that happened, then we were all immediately were, were thrown into ministry. We were able to go to be at a place where we can minister to people and it just showed how sensitive he was to the Holy Spirit that he knew something was going to happen and we were prepared before it came and when it came it was just easy for us to get into ministry and to reach out to people and to be there for them so that's uh, um, that's an experience I don't ever forget